let's try to solve a word problem based on the universal law of gravitation. Pause the video and go through this one. Do you remember the universal law of gravitation? It says that if there are two objects A and B with masses M1 and M2 separated by a distance D, then the gravitational force between them is given by this formula. And uppercase G here is called the universal gravitational constant and its value is given to us as 6.7 times 10 raised to negative 11. Newton meter squared per kilogram squared. The gravitational force is directly proportional to the product of the masses and inversely proportional to the square of the distance between them. This is the universal law of gravitation. So let M1 be Zen's mass, which is 70 kilograms, and let M2 be Zara's mass, which is 50 kilograms. And the distance D between them is 1 kilometer. Next, we check if all the units are standard. Are they? Well, the only thing we need to convert is the distance in kilometers to meters. The distance D will equal 1000 meters. We are ready to substitute these values in the formula now. Substituting the values in the formula, we get this. And solving this will give us the value of F as 2.345 times 10 raised to negative 13 N. Do you see how tiny this force is? Now you probably know why humans don't get pulled towards each other. As the masses are less and the value of G is very small, the overall force also will be minuscule. How does this force change in different cases? Now let me give you two more scenarios. First, the two objects are the Earth and a human being. Second, the two objects are the Earth and the Moon. Find the force exerted in each of the cases and tell us your answers in the comments section below.